This is SAT test 3, calculator section question 25. College Board gives us a grain silo built from two right circular cones, one at the top, one at the bottom, at a right circular cylinder. They provide this drawing with the measurements labeled. Of the following, which is closest to the volume of the grain silo? To find the volume of the grain silo, we have two cones. Each cone is one third pi r squared h. That formula is given at the front, at the start of each mass section. So that is 2 thirds pi, r is 5, times 5. And this is a calculator question. And on the calculator, we're told that's 130.9. And then we have one right circular cylinder, which is pi, r squared, h, which is pi, R is still 5, so 5 squared times h, which is 10 according to the diagram for the cylinder. So pi 5 squared times 10 is 785.4. And I wrote that twice the cone was 130, but one times the cone is 130. So I have another 130.9, but the second cone, so the top cone is 130. The middle cylinder is 785, and the bottom cone is 130. And if I add those together, I get 1047.2, roughly. And the closest answer is 1047.2. College Board will often ask you for the volume of a right circular cylinder. To do that, either you already know the formula, pi r squared h, or you can look it up in the front at the start of the section and apply that formula. Find r. They will often give you d instead of r. Remember, the radius is half the diameter. And find the height h of your cone or cylinder. So the cylinder has a height of 10 and a radius of 5. They also included cones here. And come back soon for my next math video. With math, there's always more.